Hello all. Today we are going to discuss about uh, the role of business analyst during the testing phase. Before we get down to business, do subscribe my channel below and hit the like button so that I'll get more subscribers at the same time. Whenever I put forward content, you will be able to get those content in your feed as well. Uh, now let's get down to business. So when it comes to a uh, testing phase, a business analyst would uh, be primarily involved in a session named uh, triage call. Right? So triage call is when there is a defect and the developer feels it is not a defect and the tester feels it's a defect. Now the business analyst has to come into the equation because the business analyst is, has expertise when it comes to the requirements and the system requirements. So the business analyst must give his or her views as to whether it is a defect or not. So this is where triage call comes into the picture. So say for example, another reason why we do triage call is, so a triage call will have three players, one business analyst, two tester, three developer, right? So this is how a triage call would look like. So in the case where uh, there is a defect, the tester is trying to explain the defect to the developer, but the developer is not able to understand. So this is another place where a business analyst will come into the equation. Since business analyst has expertise on the system and business and functional requirements, uh, the business analyst will expound and, uh, um, and, and, and explain the requirements to the developer so that the developer is able to understand the requirement. Uh, so this is another area. So maybe the, maybe the tester might not be able to understand the requirements as well. So uh, 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 something which is not a defect might be pointed out as a defect. Again, uh, the develop uh, the business analyst would come into the equation, and the business analyst would make sure that a consensus is reached. And if the developer or tester is not able to understand something, the business analyst will explain and make sure the developer or tester understands the requirement. So this is what happens in a triage call. So during a, during the testing phase, a business analyst is involved in triage calls. Actually, uh, there will be multiple triage calls, and you'll be involved, and you have to and you have to prove that you have expertise in the requirements. So that's expected, and this is something that you have to do uh, properly so that a good product is delivered to the business. And apart from this, if you want, you can volunteer to write test scripts, but then that's not a required to have, that's a nice to have. And apart from that, uh, you can do some smoke testing. Again, that's not a required to have, but it's a nice to have. That's some, It's not a required to do, but it's a nice to do. Uh, so these are all the uh, roles and responsibilities of a business analyst during the testing phase and hope you are able to gather something of essence uh, during this uh, uh, via this very short uh, uh, session uh, if you have any questions please do comment below i will respond to these comments uh, within one business day i'll try my best to respond to these comments as soon as possible please do subscribe to my channel like i said and hit the like button thank you have a nice day